Blake here. It's been quite a year in the Comics Cafe. At Christmas, I decided to follow Jesus. Since then, I've learned so much about Jesus. I'm so glad I decided to follow him. My sister Bree, on the other hand, she's not quite sure. She didn't really like talking to me about it. One day though, we couldn't avoid talking about Jesus anymore. It all started with a history report. This nation, under God, shall have a new birth of freedom. That government, of the people, by the people, and for the people, shall not perish from the earth. You memorized the entire Gettysburg Address. Impressive. Thanks. You know, I just love doing these living history reports every year. Uh, who's your report on, Brie? I don't know yet. Brie, we have like two days before we have to present our reports to the class. I know, I know. I mean, I thought I decided on someone, but I just can't figure this person out. They don't make any sense at all. Who is it? It's, okay. This is Mrs. Kirby's idea. Okay. And this person was supposed to be super easy to write about, and I thought I'd be done by now. Brie, what did you choose? I chose Jesus. That's a great choice. I was wondering about him, and Mrs. Kirby said that I could learn more about him by reading the Bible. And I thought I could do two things at once by giving a report about him, too. Okay, sweet. No, it's not sweet. <laughs> I mean, Jesus seems cool. I just don't understand who he actually was. Well. Whatever you are, be a good one. What? That's something Abe Lincoln said. <laughs> Look, Bree, th this project is all about learning new things. I didn't know anything about Elizabeth Blackwell before this. Who? She was the first woman in America to get a medical degree. She saved a ton of people's lives. Well, the Bible says Jesus healed people too, but... Oh, hello, yes! Yes, I know. <laughs> oh, the name's Great. Alexander the Great. Maybe you've heard of me? King of Macedonia. Mas what are ya? No, no, I'm the guy who's famous for never losing a battle. The guy who named 70 cities after the coolest thing in the world. Myself. And I even named one city after my horse. Yes, and he was from Macedonia. Did you do any research? Research. Everything I learned, I learned from books. Jesus is supposed to be a king too, but he didn't act like Alexander, and he healed sick people, but I don't think he had a medical degree. And then there's all this stuff about miracles. Oh, I should pick Jesus. Oh, he would have been way easier to research than Alex the G. I've got like 20 Bibles at home. I could have just walked over to one, picked it up, and oh, there's everything you need to know about Jesus. But Jesus can't have actually done all this stuff, can he? I mean, stopping a storm by talking to it. You know, it, it seems crazy, but I think that Jesus actually did all that. Yeah, yeah I, I mean, Jesus was pretty awesome. Character is like a tree. Reputation is like a shadow. And if you see... Mm. <laughs> um, oh, are you gonna help me? Yeah. You can help me, just careful, careful, careful. Yeah, yeah. Ow, 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 okay, okay, okay. Who is Jesus? I don't know. Look, if you need any help, Bree, I'll just be in the back. I don't know why Mr. and Mrs. K have all this medical stuff, but it is perfect for this project. I know, I was back there the other day. They have this just huge costume of a duck. Where'd they get all this stuff?